Hey, what's going on guys and girls and welcome to the Top Tier Boxing YouTube channel. There's a girl in a shop window there looking at me. Not in a good way, she's just like wondering why I'm filming myself. It's 2023, people film themselves now. Although I still do get very self-conscious. I've been doing this years, by the way. Uh, we'll, we'll talk about that in a bit, but more on boxing. Brand new channel, first thing I need you guys to do is hit that subscribe button. Do us an absolute solid because any revenue that we've received from this channel goes straight back into the events to make them bigger and better than before. And in my experience, we're gonna need to get quite a few subscribers. So uh, yes, hit that subscribe button and then we can crack on with this very first vlog. The reason for this first vlog is uh, just to introduce you to not just me, but John as well, the main man. More so John, to be honest, because he's put this all together. So I've just pulled up to top tier boxing. We're on Google Maps. Aye, aye. Look at this. Hello. Hello, sir. There he is. Look at this. Come in. Come in. First thing we need to do, mate, is sort this door out. Yeah, give it a good old I'm not strong enough. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, so the first thing, um, I needed a storeroom. So rather than a storeroom, I thought, you know what? Make it look like a shop. Yeah, looks cool. It, it, these are fighter kits. So obviously oh, that's okay. for management. And then we've got the uh, top tier. So all the boxers will be getting one of these for training. Perfect. And then on the back, that will be the sponsors of the show. Nice. Yeah, you know I mean? So on the promo videos we're going to do, they'll be wearing them. Special treatment for every boxer then. Yeah. Love it. And, and, and everyone asks me, oh, let's have a go. Well, yeah, come sign to us and you can have one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's where the interviews will be, obviously. We're doing some interviews here. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So my punch machine's going here, and believe me, me and my wife have been pretending to punch it and make sure we had enough room for a left hand. And yeah, for a right hand. I'm left-handed, so I'm yeah, going to need some room. We don't want to be banging the wall. This is it. This was meant to be part of the shop. Okay. The fake shop. Yeah, it's a well hydrator sponsoring it as well. But unfortunately, they've lent it to Boxer Sky Sports. Oh. So what I said is, I'm going to come down there, get the top score, and he went, well, if you don't get the top score, you can't have it. And I was like, oh, shit. You're quite good on them, aren't you? Yeah, I'm very good on them. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Okay, into this room here. Oh yeah, mate, you've, you've really, you've gone in. Like, properly gone in. Yeah, like I, didn't, I didn't expect it to be this far down this the line. This is red as well. Red door, yeah? Yeah, red door. Yeah, so the vision is, press conference day. I've got five stalls coming. So we have four boxes. So one, two, three, four, five stalls there. Presenter in the middle, top tier behind her. And the two each side from the price fire. Are you visioning it? I'm, I can see it now. Yeah, it looks smart, mate. It's a little bit, I think it's a bit skew if though. Did they put a spirit level on that? Yeah, we actually had a level, a <laughs> laser level. The wife was like, it is a little bit out. So listen, who is going to see it, analyse it and go, it's a bit out. They're just going to see it and think, oh, that goes to the wall that's meant to be there. First person to see it, yeah, yeah, it's a bit kiwi. <laughs> so we got, these are going to be what people use to come in. Nice. Do you know the tramp stamps? I don't I'm not a fan of all that. So wristbands only, yeah? Wristbands, yeah. Lanyards to go around as well. Nice. There'll be the tables. And then I tried um, ordering it online. So you know when you get the little piece of card and that? They're talking uh, £600 to order them. I thought, well, I might as well make them myself. So I thought, well, laminate it on. <laughs> <laughs> We're going in. Let's rewind for a second, because yeah. obviously people that are going to be watching this will probably know who you are. Yeah. and know what you're doing. But for anyone that doesn't, rewind right to the beginning and say what the hell you've been up to. Wow. So I joined Let's Go Management as basically an assistant. And what Let's Go was is a management company. We sign boxers, get them on shows, look after them, treat them well. And obviously the care packages is how I manage myself. Sorry, put my back to you. Um, That's better. Yeah, so we've got one of these out to each boxer. Obviously they're good quality, uh, with a nice bag, just to help build the brand. My job in them was just to keep the boxers happy, keep them hungry um, and loved, mm. because it's a lonely sport and they try hard, so little things like this go a long way. Um, and everything that I'm learning from now, I'm trying to bring into my own promotion. So let's go also promoting now as well. Um, they've got a massive deal that's going to be announced soon, I can't talk about it yet. Um, but also wanted to make my own lane and let's go need boxers on other shows as well. Mm. So with that, I was like, well, I'm going to build a brand called Top Tier. So far, so good. It's got a lot of attention, mm. learning from people like yourself and slowly putting things out. They're not getting too happy and smashing it out and, you know, building the hunger. Mm. And literally every day, when's, when's the poster out, John? When's this out? Who's on it? And I'm like, I'll tell you. <laughs> I'll tell you soon. I'll tell you yeah. soon. So fast forward to now, what's the, what's the plan? Right, so... We've set up a show, and with Top Tier, 
I want to be top tier by name, top tier by nature. So in boxing, you get small hall, and then you get Sky Sports, BT Sports, the big hall shows mm. uh, like Wembley, your favourite stadium, Tottenham. Yeah. Mm. But there's a market for in between that. So medium hall. So I haven't got a small mind when it comes to business, putting on shows. You know yourself. I like expensive things, nice things, things to look good and well presented. Yeah. So I'm going to put on the best small hall shows that I possibly can. Uh, without these, sorry, this wouldn't be possible because there's not a lot of money in it. You know, there, there's boundaries on how much money you can spend. So without sponsors, you, you couldn't do it. It'd no. be impossible. No. Obviously, with my business mind, everything I make from the first show will be kept, stored, put into the second show, and that's how I'll build my brand. Yeah. But for a profit, there won't be much. No. It's just about building my brand now. So with top tier, I've managed to gather some of the best people in the business to do like the ring, um, the production in there. So I'm gonna have big LED screens, um, the walkway to, the catwalk they call it, to, to the ring, nice black shiny glossy, um, the venue, um, one of the best venues for small hall shows, Brentwood Leisure Centre. Um, so you sorted, yeah, you've got that. Yeah, I've got that now. Four shows this year, because mm -hmm. I started a bit late, but next year it'll be five. But on them shows, so I've got everything's in line. I've got the best production, the best rings, you know, like one of the best venues. I need to have the best events. Mm. And in boxing, to get that, it's very hard to get people on the way up, fighting other people on the way up. So what I thought was prize fighter. So that's a tournament on the night. So every one of my shows, and not a big one, so just four people, four boxers, sorry, in a semi-final leading into a final. Mm. That keeps, if you come to watch, say, Jimmy Croxon, one of my shows, and uh, you see a semi-final, mm. you'll be like, oh, I don't want to lose, I want to see the final. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I need to get the bar bill up as well. I need to make sure the venue do well. Yeah. I need to make sure the sponsors have a good night while they're at my show. Mm -hmm. And the neutrals, because I'm a good salesman, mm. I'm going to companies and selling tables. Yeah, yeah. Um, and so I need to make sure the night of a whole is enjoyable for everyone. I want to have a good reputation. And after the first event, I'm pretty confident that my phone will blow up with people asking to be on the show. Because Jimmy Croxon will come, people from his gym will be there to support, everyone mm -hmm. from his gym will be like, I want to be on that show. Yeah, yeah. Well looked after, you've got a tracksuit, you've got a bag, you've got a, a ticket bag to sell your tickets from so you don't lose nothing, you can keep it all tight. The show, the production was amazing, the filming will be amazing too. Um, the photos are for afterwards, the highlight reels, hopefully going viral, and then at the end of it, they'll be like, no, I was looked after, I enjoyed it, I want to be on the next one. Mm. But I need to keep it entertaining, then obviously the best will carry on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then with the prize fighter, whoever performs very well on my show, you could be on the next show, maybe in the prize fighter, and build it around him. Yeah. And how many fights in the night in total have you got? Uh, so far, it's looking, I know it's 11, but it's looking 12 to 13. Wow. Yeah. Good, good debuts from Let's Go. We're obviously giving them an outlet and local people as well, local Essex boxers. Yeah, so listen, the show's set up to be amazing, but I need to perform there. I need to help sell the tickets, mm -hmm. help them sell the tickets. I'm a promoter, I'm not just gonna give them a ticket and say, yeah, see oh, you later, you go, good yeah, luck. Yeah. You know, I'm, I'm gonna help them out. So with your help, we get the promo videos done, we build the show, build the social media. Listen, it's got a lot of buzz about it already, mm. especially coming off from Let's Go, like that's, Massive inboxing in there. Yeah, John hasn't really, you touched on media and stuff, but that's obviously where you've got me involved, right? Yes. There he is, look, he's showing off his teeth. Yeah, I've been in this game for years, years and years, but I'm not into boxing. I, I, I'm more of a bandwagon fan, yep. so I, I'll, I'll jump on the, uh, you know, Joshua fights and whatnot. But yeah, big ones. Yeah, as far as like small hall and things like that, it's, 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 it's beyond me and, and like, Probably the rules and the, the setup to boxing is completely yeah. alien. So I'm looking forward to learning some new stuff. But yeah. I think we share a passion in sort of like low down, small, not amateur, but like I love non-league football. So I'm always promoting that. So I guess this is not the equivalent, but it's kind of like the lowest point of, of yeah. professional. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Debut so, to five, five, yeah, six, yeah. So, five, six. So when it comes to football, I'm always promoting non-league. And, you know, we've got awards for that sort of stuff. So mm -hmm. I can't wait to sort of uh, shine the light on like smaller boxers who one day you never know they fight on this show in five ten years time they might be you know heavyweight champion of the world who knows yeah it's not to say that they will but they you never you never know who they you all start across. somewhere you've got to start somewhere Arnold mm. Schwarzenegger started somewhere he did the world's strongest man started somewhere he did top tier boxing started somewhere started here
It's like here, yeah, it's like right here. So um, yeah, that's my job. I'm going to be behind this. You won't see me much on the camera. You might see me or hear me behind it. Mm -hmm. But uh, plan going forward is next up is promos, aren't we? Yes. So I've got a guy called Q. I met him in Thailand. Uh, awesome guy. Does Muay Thai boxing, filming. Crazy. Skills. Very, very good in that that department. So uh, I'm going to be leaning on him for boxing promos. Um, they're going to look sick, cinematic, um, and again, these boxes are going to have these like images that look like really professional. So again, it, it, it kind of goes with what John was saying there. John or Johnny? Either, either. To be fair, mum and dad, Johnny, because my dad's John. Johnny boy. Yeah, but on obviously my birth certificate is John, so I'm easy. I'm, I'm easy. easy. I'm easy. But, um, turn my head to either. So yeah. Don't but this was top tier vlogs. Uh, expect more of these and loads of content coming, including punch machines when it's here. Yeah. See you soon.